This is how you assemble our canoe. Release the two buckles to open up the box. Unroll your boat and take out all parts. Assemble the two borders. Female, male, female, male, female. Hold down the little tube with your thumb for easy assembly and slide them gently into each other. Flip the hull on the side. Put one border on the side, under the loops. Make sure it's aligned in the middle. Note that the bigger side of the borders is pointing to what will become the inside of the boat. Push the aluminum border on the border of the boat. A gentle hit can help get it into position. Consolidate the borders by tightening the loops. Do this over for the other border. Now it's time to get the seats into place. The side of each seat point to the nose of the boat. Buckle and tightly tie them down at each side. Fold in and gently tighten the nose. Fold in the wings and tighten the nose a little more. Do the same with the other nose. Strap down the small seat even more with the crossing straps. Make sure to do this in communicating order. Sometimes you have to untighten one to be able to tighten or buckle another. Bring over buckle and tighten the loose straps from the side of the nose. Squeeze everything together with your hands and legs. Tighten all straps one by one. This should result in a nose with a nice fluid line. Now it's time to do the other end. Once both noses are nicely tightened, it's time to put in the V-shaped ribs. Release the buckles from the sides of the seats. The aluminum tubes fit in the T-shaped buckles on top and in the rubber piece at the bottom. Assemble everything in a corner and then gently push it until it flops in place. Once all straps are positioned inside the boat, you're ready to go.